just a quick video everyone just to let everybody know that I'll be meeting my son here in about 20 minutes half hour uh, him and his girlfriend are coming up spending a couple days uh, if I'm not online for a day or so uh, that's why I want to spend as much time with my son as I can I don't get a chance to see him that often when I do it's very precious um, I'll be uh, staying there in the camp and they'll be staying in the tent uh, it's kind of nippy out here already and it's only about seven o'clock so I'll probably end up starting the generator hooking up the heater for them uh, just give my son instructions not to put the heater too close to the tent walls just to avoid the fire uh, I'll probably spend most of the night um, when they're in the tent sleeping whatever um, down here have the nice hot fire going uh, plenty of plenty of water bring the coffee and creamer down um, it's under a huge pine tree so it shades me uh, quite a bit so and it's surrounded by thick thick woods thick brush so the wind won't be an issue for me um, right now I'm just uh, letting the fire die down because uh, my son wants to take me out to a restaurant to eat um, so I don't want to leave a, a fire going when we're gone it's just not appropriate my son's going through uh, some medical issues right now uh, he just had an exam on his eyes and his right eye is not where it needs to be so they're talking about glasses he's a little frustrated with that my son spent all of his life using his eyes to make a living and now they're talking about corrective lenses so uh, he's a little uh, distraught but um, like I told him on the phone it's gonna work out he just needs to uh, go with the flow and do what the doctors tell him and see how it goes in relation to where I am right now with the fire um, that's the birch trees where the 20 by 20 building ultimately is going to go so I'm about 50 feet uh, over this direction actually not even it's probably close to 30 feet <coughs> um, obviously the canopy and the tent and generator just a lot of my mind right now and I don't know where to begin um, they say the best way to start a conversation is in the beginning but when it comes to my son I have to tread very lightly because um, he's how should I say this uh, searching for answers that I may not have the answers uh, to give and uh, I don't know I don't get a chance to spend that much time with my son and uh, it's just very unfortunate because uh, I was never really there for him when he was growing up. I was too busy involved in drugs, alcohol, gangs, traveling. So I uh, made some sacrifices that I shouldn't have made and unfortunately a lot of those bridges I burnt can't be repaired. Uh, hypothetically I didn't burn no actual bridges but you know what I'm saying but uh, I don't know <clears throat> I visited my wife tonight well late this afternoon and then eve this evening and she's doing good um, she's getting very restless in there she wants to leave the facility um, and I discussed again with her the possibility of uh, Roanoke, Virginia and you know it, it's just a matter of timing it's a matter of finances and right now I don't know um, I guess I'm kinda short on words right now which is kinda odd I normally am rambling on for hours you know 
but right now I just my mind is overloaded and uh, I don't know where my son wants to take me out to a restaurant for supper tonight I'm uh, very anxious to that I haven't actually had that luxury in quite some time it's getting kind of dark in here right now <laughs> Which is fine with me. Um, the thing about being in the woods when it gets dark is it gets dark pretty damn quick. And with that comes the cold air. Yeah, it's getting pretty cold in here right now. <laughs> Had rain showers most of the day today, so everything got saturated and got wet. It was damp. And I tell you what, boys and girls, too. <laughs> uh, my bones, I feel it. Uh, believe me, I feel it. When I was younger, I complained that rain for hours didn't bother me. Now, as soon as a drop hits the ground, my bones hurt. I guess that's a sign of arthritis and old age combined. I'm not as young as I used to be, folks. All right, well, I'm gonna shut this uh, camera off and uh, when my son picks me up, we'll go someplace and I'll get a connection and uh, upload it. Uh, I'll put it on YouTube and share it to Facebook. I hope my videos bring some sort of enjoyment to people, uh, a little bit of entertainment. Um, if not, I apologize, but like I said in a couple of my videos earlier, this is how I deal with a lot of things in my life. I make little videos, sometimes they make sense, most of the times they don't. But this is how I deal with things that's been going on in my life for the past 30 plus years. So, please bear with me, and I don't mean to offend anybody. Alright folks, I'll catch you all later.